I mean, speaking of marriage, um, you know, since our last interview, Will Smith uh, wrote a book. Right. And he talked about Tupac mm -hmm. in the book. He said, mm -hmm. I hated that I wasn't what Tupac was in the world. And I suffered and and I suffered a raging jealousy. I wanted Jada to look at me like that. I heard, I saw that. And the two, their relationship is so, I don't know, just you scratch your head because it almost seems like something bad happened between them and she's going to publicly embarrass him over and over again until well, <laughs> whatever, whatever's this. fulfilled in, in her heart. I can say this. Them. I've made so many horrible mistakes in my relationship. I'm in no position to talk, but I will say this. Okay. You're not fair to tell my business on TV all the fucking time. <laughs> I want to go on the red table. Hey, bitch, you got to talk to this kitchen table. <laughs> you think we live in all, we, you think we live in this good because those set it off residuals? You think, you think they make it Nurse Hawthorne too? <laughs> <laughs> Jason's lyric ain't right, they ain't the doing that again and Tupac is dead he is so at, at a certain point I think the grace that we generally extend to anybody else outside of our partners we have a hard time extending to them and there's a certain amount of grace you need to have with somebody who you've taken vows to there's a certain, certain yeah. amount of grace you used to have and that seems decidedly ungraceful to me right it's down, not, to, it's the, not, down yeah. to the entanglement I'm like mm -mm. August Alcina I'm not, you know, I'm not, there's a certain amount of, there's a certain amount of, uh, like, even if, 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 you can lie to protect too, right? Like, yeah, you can, you can of go, course. I don't want to. I've done lots of that. But, but if you just did fucking, I'm gonna, like, I, I'm in no position to speak about somebody else's dynamic. I will say this again. There is a certain amount of grace you need to have with somebody that you've decided to marry and stay with and be intimate with. And there are things you can't unsee and things you, like, you need to give people grace. And if you don't, you can be honest, but not brutal. Brutal, brutal and honesty don't go together. We put them in the same sentence. But now all of a sudden, you, you, you really emphasize the brutal. The honesty part is. Well, I also feel that your, your personal relationships should be protected. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's a reason why I've never specifically spoken about my personal relationships mm -hmm. because I feel they should be protected. And I feel that they shouldn't be used as promo or a, a revenue source or clout or whatever, whatever else you call it, because all that shit doesn't matter. Cause at, at some point the lights will get turned off and the cameras will, will dim. And you know, you have to still live with that person. That's you still have to relate to that person. So why put it all out there and use it as material and, and use it to advance your career and, and use it for other people's entertainment because they're going to go on to something else the next day. Yes. As exciting as the entanglement was that week, no one gave a shit a week later, but Will still got to live with that shit. I, he like still has to see the comments. You have to, and, certain, you have to have a certain amount of grace with the person that you're intimate with. A certain amount of grace. And, yeah. I, and I can't say where the line is for a lot of people. Like I tend to say things out loud because I don't want somebody else to come up and be, and be saying I said something. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you, goddamn it, this would happen. Yeah. Because, and so when you've lived your life a certain way and, and start out a certain way, like you gotta kind of finish it that way. But I think, um, I just, I, I don't understand what the need, um, I, I, just, I just think you have to have a certain amount of grace for people, yeah. a certain amount of empathy. Mm -hmm. 